so it's our first day here my camera's tripping check it out miami is probably like 45 minutes away from here and uh we're going to go look for some food right now see if we find something good there's a lot of cuban food out here but i've never tried it i might have to try it today and um yeah after this we're gonna see what we do maybe go cast some spoons out so the first thing we did right after we ate was pull up to the pier it was literally like five minutes away from the hotel we were staying at so it was perfect this pier is called dania beach fishing pier it was really nice we didn't even have to go anywhere we literally bought bait right there they had drinks and food pretty much everything you need to be fishing they even had a restroom and uh so this is the first time we fished out in some clear water we're not used to fishing in this type of water as you can see i know that galveston water is way different looking than this is but it was nice to be out there and check out the water and we actually saw some fish swimming by it's crazy because over here you don't see that you can't see the fish you're literally just blind casting but anyway we didn't fish for too long because i didn't want to be tired the next day all right so we finally made it uh, I'm here for the training today at Florida Car Wrap. Hopefully I'm here on the right day because there's nobody here, man. <laughs> uh, but it's right here in front of us. I'm a little bit early, so we'll see if more people show up. Or if not, I'm going to I'm gonna go in there and I'm going to start teaching them how to wrap instead. No, I'm playing. But, uh, yeah. After this, hopefully we can do some fishing if I'm not too tired because it's super early. It's like 750 but over here it's uh 8 852 but we'll see how it goes i'm gonna try to record some video inside all right so of course i went to the wrong place that's why there was no one there check out that hotel in the background that's a new hotel in a quarter mile maybe we'll check it out later but we're pulling up to the correct place i am late now but that's their fault <laughs> not but uh they hit me up and let me know where it's at. I'm about to see what goes down.
trying to get some bait right now. Check out this water, super clear. I'm kind of scared to drop my phone. Got all the rods here. GG anglers. Trying to get some bait out here. I don't even see no fish. Yeah, he's trying to get some bait right now, so we can use that. Yeah, we're gonna use this shrimp here. We only got two dozen. I wanna see you get one. What he's using for uh, <laughs> to catch fish. It's a beaky rig. They're like so small, the camera can't even focus on it. They're like super, super small. Now. But they work. It's crazy. Damn. That's the type of water we need at Galveston. Got some more. See, I don't understand how those little hooks with no bait on them they work. <laughs> oh, I guess that little white thing is like a lure. Those are like perfect size too. They're like the mullet of Florida. Man, I wish Galveston or Texas City was like this, man. That was a super long drive, man. Super tired. It took forever to get back. I felt like the, the way back was longer than the way going or something. But uh, we made it. Everything went well. I'm really happy with the training, the class that I went to. I did learn a few new tricks. 
Um, the good thing is that I do feel pretty confident with my skills because this is the first time I ever went to a class and I did feel like I already knew a good amount of information uh, being that I've never taken a class before. But yeah, if anything, if they have anything else in the future, I'd be really happy to go again and uh, see what else happens. Also, the fishing out there was pretty cool. I wish we could stay longer, man. Like, I wish we could stay a little bit longer so we could do some, some fishing for real because things out there are different than here, so we gotta change our tactics. And uh, yeah, so I would wanna go again and hopefully have some more time, maybe spend like two weeks there and really get to see some more places, do some more fishing, meet some more people. But anyway, I, I appreciate you guys for watching the videos. Make sure to like and subscribe to the channel. And I'll see you guys next time.